what I show a realtor is like, look here, let's look at this $800,000 example. The monthly payment would be $63,59. If we're putting 5% down, it's $57,000, right? Do you see a client that could fit in this circle? And they're like, yeah, that's, I could totally see that. Okay, cool. If we're looking at two and a half percent commission, right? You're looking at $20,000. So if you find a, a listing where you're in a competitive scenario now, and the listing agent is saying, hey, the other offer is waiving uh, the commission that they're just going to pay for it out of pocket, even if they were sharing cooperative commission previously. But now because of the competition, they're not going to be able to provide that because the other offer is showing that they won't do it. But your realtor has a great relationship, whatever the case is, Mr. and Mrs. Realtor, let me show you what it could look like if we built that 20K into the price point payment goes from 63.59 to 65.18. That less than $200 difference there is going to be able to allow this client to finance that commission in there so they can still be equipped with the right negotiation skills, contractual knowledge, and knowledge of the process in a way that they just didn't have the research to get on their own. Okay, but so see, what if it doesn't appraise? What if it still only appraises 800? Well, if it doesn't appraise 800, Right, we can change the the down payment from five percent to three and a half percent. Now it's sixty five thousand dollars out of pocket with sixty four sixty eight, and so there they go. Okay, so if they have to pay some of it out of pocket, at least they're not paying a whole twenty grand. Right, some of it's still finance, others it's still in the loan. So that might be doable. But then if they go, yeah, but so see, what if they don't have another seven thousand dollars to put out of pocket? Well, this is now where we could look at going a higher uh, rate to now combine both lender credit and appraisal gap strategy so that we can come back to the $56,000 cash to close. The payment difference is now $438, but what would this client rather have? $438 difference a month or paying an extra $20,000 out of pocket or not being able to afford the house at all, get your services, get them at home and continue to see prices increase and then miss out on the neighborhood they want to buy in, right? And so- there is no silver bullet for any of this. There's just the ability to show, don't panic. It doesn't mean it's going to be as bad as you're assuming. There's hope, there's strategy, and worst case, there's opportunity for people to still both finance it with the appraisal gap and do lender credits on the commission. People are making bad financial decisions because they've only been exposed to conventional wisdom that's outdated or fear-fueled, right? People are making bad financial decisions because they're only exposed to conventional wisdom that's outdated or fear-fueled. And so it's our job as consultants to come in and the way we lead is we lead through perspective. My job is to show somebody a better decision by showing them their two results, right? Two alternative futures. If you don't buy now, here A. If you don't buy now, here A with more down payment here. If you don't buy, if you do buy now and then refi when lower rates happen here, here are your three futures. Which one do you want? My job is to paint a picture for someone of their future realities so they can make better financial decisions now. And the only way I can do my job well is by painting that picture through the canvas of mortgage coach.